The South Carolina legislature was in session when word came that Lincoln had been elected. They had already discussed what would they do in that eventuality. So they sent out word to the districts at the time to select delegates to come to a convention of the people in the Columbia, the state capital. Abbeville had a planning committee that met on 14 uh, November 1860 and decided to have a mass meeting of the people of the district on 22 November 1860. On that Thursday morning, about 3,000 people gathered in front of the courthouse. That was marching band, militia units, and they marched about the three blocks over to uh, Magazine Hill, as it was known at the time. The planning committee had already built a speaker's platform, speeches were given, and then they eventually selected six delegates to represent the Abbeville district. On 17 December, Abbeville six delegates, along with 163 others from across the state, gathered in Columbia. That was a smallpox outbreak. All 169 delegates got on a train and went to Charleston. And on 20 December 1860, the Ordinance of Secession was signed. And thus, South Carolina dissolved her relation with the Union of the United States. Because of the decision that was made in Charleston on 20 December, and the fact that Abbeville claims to have held the first mass meeting to select delegates, Magazine Hill today is known as Secession Hill.